the year is 2025. Keyword research, backlinks are a thing of stone age. They no more exist in the world of chat GPT, which has taken over SEO, completely changed it. There are no more jobs in SEO. Everyone has lost their jobs, money, security, everything. Well, you might have heard all of these statements coming all around the internet and exploding your brain as to what is going to happen in the field of SEO. You could be nothing related to SEO. Ho sakta hai, aapka SEO se koi matlab hi na ho. But it is being fed to us itne zyada deep tarike se that we for one feel ki hamari naukri khatre mein to nahi hai. Well, for different reasons it could be, but not necessarily for what it is being publicized as. Hello everybody. Welcome to B10X. I'm Antriksh. And I'm here to talk about, is SEO dead? Well, the answer lies somewhere in the middle. And I would say it lies somewhere on the side of SEO. Let me explain. So what is SEO? SEO, I don't understand a very basic way because I believe when you are here, you are onto this channel, you are onto this video right now, you know what the basics of SEO are. But what I mean by SEO is in a very mota mota format, if I'd say it in Hindi, सबसे पहले सबसे टॉप में किस तरीके से क्या शो होता है इट्स अ रेस फॉर एवरीवन टू गेट देयर द हायर यू आर द बेटर चांसेस यू हैव ऑफ गेटिंग योर वेबसाइट योर आर्टिकल योर प्रोडक्ट योर डिस्क्रिप्शन योर कमेंट बीइंग क्लिक्ड दैट इज ऑल अबाउट एसईओ दैट इज व्हाट एवरीवन इज बीटिंग देयर हेड्स अबाउट नाउ व्हाई डू वी से क्यों हम ऐसा कह रहे हैं कि एसईओ इज चेंज्ड एसईओ इज डेड एसईओ इज नो मोर आरआईपी एसईओ व्हाई आर वी सेइंग ऑल ऑफ दिस वन Google Sundar Pichai ki conference mein recently he stated that SEO will now change a bit. Now he did not explicitly say ki SEO change ho raha hai guys. He just said ki ab the AI, the uh, the the search results would be sort of inculcated in AI. AI would be inculcated in search results moreover. So Microsoft also announced this ki they would power with uh, it their search results would be powered with GPT. And Bing jo hoga, ab wo usi sab se results dikhayega as if it were on GPT. That is that. Bard yahan se, GPT yahan se, onto search results. What does the average consumer do? Nothing. We search as usual. But what about SEO professionals? How are they going to be harmed or aided? That is where the question comes into play. That is why everyone seems to be freaking around the town about what is happening in SEO. Now, we... As one, don't have clarity itni zada about what minor, minor, what is the integrity of the changes. But up look in this video, mein aayo. Aap log kyun aayo is video mein? like has SEO drawn you towards it? No, up look in video mein isle aayo to know beat and X's views, to know my views. So that is what is going to remain constant in SEO. Now, what do I mean by that? Abhi kya bol raha hai what, how is a YouTube video connected to SEO? Well, let me explain. SEO, when we see it's in danger, when we say it's in danger, what we mean by that is some of SEO's work is being done by none other than AI. Now, what do we mean by that? We go on chat GPT. So what did we used to do? The, the One of the best and the most potent examples of SEO is related to blogs. You know, the blog industry and everything just works on SEO or at least it worked on SEOs. What are, when do we read most of the blogs? So we go in, best chair. If you have a specific price point, you type in. If you have a specific use case, you say office chairs. If you have something, some color in mind, some brand in mind, you type in there. You type all about that and you get it. What does it show? It shows the results according to who, whichever is whoever site is the best optimized or whatever. And then we get the results and we read a load of, you know, whatever is written there. And finally, we get our recommendations if we're lucky. Now, what does ChatGP do? Anything related to these how-to videos, what is happening, how are we going to get these factual bases would all, in my opinion, and this is just purely my opinion, is going to be replaced by chat GPT. So what do I mean by that yet again? Matlab, agar aapko ek specific use case poochna hai, agar aapko kisi cheez ka kuch poochna hai, chat GPT will be there for you and it will give you a direct sort of answer to your questions. Jo jisse aapko ek blog nahi padna padega. So that would really replace that essence of SEO. Now we have something in Google called as EEAT, which is experience, expertise, authoritativeness, 
and trustworthiness. So we all have heard EAT. And now we also hear EEAT. Now this specifically defines what is going to remain constant in the field of ever-changing AI and SEO. What I mean by that? Experience and expertise. Now Google laid out their sort of picheka secret info as they call it for um, you know SEO people we would really require experience and expertise. Now, it's it's a different question that how their algorithm is going to detect whether the blog or whatever, whatever written material is, in fact, expertise is full of expertise or is it just some 14-year-old kid in the corner trying to, you know, give a review of a thing that he has never purchased? That is a question to be answered later. But jo cheese hai, experience, expertise, authoritativeness and trustworthiness, this is something which AI can't replace and that is something which we here at beat and have always been preaching ai is not going to replace you a person who knows how to use ai will so ai as a technology nahi it will change the landscape of jobs yes seo may jobs come hogi. again this is just my opinion kis cheez ki kam hogi? you know people take five rupees per word and they write sub average content for you know product descriptions which they copy paste from amazon or they write about places they've never been before. What do they do? They look out for other blogs and then they copy paste it with the advent of, you know, um, these, um, these uh, what do we call it? Editing softwares. They edit whatever copy pasted material is there and then they present it. And then they get paid in words for that. That is going to go. That is just purely and simply would be replaced by GPT, would be replaced by BART. What they cannot replace is Antriksh standing here, taking a flight, going to Dehradun, going into a homestay, living there for five days, experiencing the valley, coming back, recording everything in his phone, coming back with a memory, you know, with a bag full of memory and then typing it down, then making a video on it. This can never be replaced by AI. What Antriksh can do here is to quote unquote, preserve his job as a SEO marketer is actually use leverage chat GPT, go on, search, make use of the different tools available, which by the way, our workshop gives in hefty numbers. So if you want to know anything and everything about AI tools, don't forget to sign up for our workshop. The link would be down in the description. So what do these tools do? They give us the best keywords. They give us the best times. They give us the best descriptions. They give us the best strategies. And that is how you can use and leverage chat GPT and other tools to your benefit. Did it replace you? No, it can never replace me traveling to a place, making my own memories. You know, when we talk about generic niche, now I won't even call it niche because generic, you know, there is no niche attached to it. Had there been a niche, it wouldn't have been generic. So I'm um, sort of an oxymoron there. But when we talk about generic stuff, yes, yes and yes, AI is here to kill SEO. But that is unfortunately not what SEO is all about. As I talk to you, you know, SEO is a lot more conversational in nature. SEO, as Google themselves have said, it's about experience and expertise now. What you actually have faced and you will help other people get out of it. So that is where the personal touch, the actual value of a man using AI, of a person behind AI, the brains behind AI would come into play. What I mean by that? What I mean by that is exactly how, you know, you just can't determine anything that you are getting into. It is how you play that thing. It is how you are made for it is what is going to determine how the bigger picture is going to be shaped. You know, it's easy to fall into traps. It's God forbid if you're in the SEO market right now, you would be panicked. But one thing which you don't require right now is panic. Why tumhe lambi gheri saas? Lambi saas chodo, lambi saas lo, lambi saas chodo and think, write down clearly what as an SEO marketer, what as an SEO, as a SEO professional should be your next goal. It should be upgrading yourself. It should be taking a course, something like we offer and just, you know, upgrading, updating yourself to the best AI tools, to the best AI knowledge available. And it's not just me, you know, coming here and talking about my course. It's actually what hundreds and thousands of people are doing. You upgrade yourself. We saw, you know, I, I think it was 16 or 14 when the Google's voice result came in and every, oh my God, SEO industry is disrupted. You know, people would be so much more comfortable in, 
you know written results written content has gone it's all about search no kahi nahi gaya kahi nahi gaya kuch bhi yes voice has been inculcated into the whole environment it has sort of found its place there and it to be honest didn't even make that big of a deal but to some to some people it may have done but to the whole market scenario the basics always remain the same as long as you keep upgrading updating yourself nothing is there to you know sort of be worried and you know you just take a deep breath you think about how you need to upgrade yourself and how to upgrade yourself quickly i would say in the most efficient and in the most quick manner wherein you are not one who leaves anything behind or you yourself are not left behind so that sort of was a you know no no one you know i i i would not pose as a god and say mujhe ye pata hai seo ke bare mein mujhe wo pata hai or i know what's going to happen with seo well things may actually take a turn for like uh, you know words in 2000 for seo people but we don't know that because you know google we have seen doesn't really care about jobs you know their own jobs let alone jobs being affected by their decisions for sure but what i also know is a huge chunk of its business comes from seo and sem you know which inculcates the paid marketing as well they won't just give it up for ai and they won't just sacrifice that part of the revenue if you think from a business standpoint so what you need to recognize is some minor tweaks a little major ones as well would keep happening we're in the world of ai wherein aapko kal ka nahi pata yaar so you can't really decide ek saal baad ka or you know plan for all you can do is presently i'm seeing reels i'm seeing youtube shorts i'm seeing content i'm seeing ads about ai so what is the natural response if you're an ai professional upgrade yourself that was the only message about uh, uh, from me about um, you know um, what sort of seo is and how seo is shaping up the rest remains uncertain yet certain if you know you know change is the only constant as they say so with that thought um kuch zyada nahi hoga you know we just need to think about upgrading ourselves and that is it so yeah again with that thought um it's me antrik signing off and thank you so much to everyone who was there um abhi tak is video mein um just a small request um if you could uh, like this video subscribe to the channel beat nx turn the notification bell on because anytime we'll post a video it'll be there for you on your notification window and you'll click on it and be upgraded so keep upgrading yourself subscribe to the channel and thank you so much take care